Hello everyone, Rudar here with another Grounded video. Today's video will be going over killing the bees and what I have found to be one of the easiest and best ways for me to do it. So before we even get started shooting at the bees, because that's what we're going to be doing, let's go over one where I'm standing, which is over here in the western part of the yard. There's the picnic table and you can see on the screen there is the beehive. My setup is going to be the insect bow with a bunch of gas arrows, the gas mask, the shoulder guard from the spider set, and aphid slippers. I want to be able to run around as quickly as possible. That's why I have those two pieces on. We also have on buff lungs for the enhanced energy capacity or increased stamina. The cardio fan for the more efficient respiration process or more efficient use of the stamina. And meat shield for the increase of your overall health. Also with me I have my healing smoothies, smoothie question marks. I have some bandages. And I even have the human food for the damage resistance, which I'll be activating all those uh, right after I make them all angry. We're going to come over here underneath the beehive. First, we're going to grab the nectar on the ground. This is a great spot to grab nectar. They generally drop it on the ground over here. They will come down to pick it up every now and then, but for the most part, it's right there. I have found that most, there's 26 is the most I've ever found. But let's go ahead and one... Equip the right arrows, which are those. We're going to go... I'm in first person so I can have a very accurate shot. So I make sure I hit the beehive. Because that's the goal is to hit the beehive. We're going to hit the beehive. Which out of first person because I'm not a fan of it personally. Activate the human food smoothie. And I'm going to go ahead and activate a bandage while I'm at it. Now what I want to do is I just want to keep dancing around. If I can circle around and make them stay in the gas, I can make this kill a little bit easier for myself. Now you see I'm trying to stay away from them as much as possible because they do hit very hard. This is a medium. As you can see, I've got three now plus the one dead one. So I have quite a few that are after me. And I have to have, I have, to have another one drop dead. So we've got two now. I've already killed three. And the goal is to just do my best to keep them in the gas cloud. So I did get hit right there. You saw that was one hit and like half health. So another one flew in and now it's mad. So now, as you can see, I've turned this into a, a very nice little area of, you know, bee carnage. So yes, I am using a bunch of gas arrows, but it is most definitely very effective. So, let's make sure I don't have any more bees coming down to mess with me. I do see this one. I'm keeping an eye on it to see if it wants to come down and play. It does not. So, in the matter of uh, quite a few arrows, I'm going to say, you know, let's pick all these up. I think like 30-something arrows. I have one, two, three, four, five six dead bees and that took me how long not very long now it was tricky you definitely want to save before you try this because like i said they hit very hard and if two of them are hitting you at the exact same time it's it's pretty much an instant death because of they just because of how hard they hit and they have a triple attack which literally drops you to one shot uh, even when it's one-on-one -on -one with no problem. But I had, what, six bees. So, I already had two bee fuzz on me when I started this. So right there, I've got seven fuzz and three stingers out of these guys. But I just kind of wanted to go over that right there. Um, I know I have uh, had my, had some shout-outs from some buddies of mine, Sir Similot and the Mike Lowry Show, for the method that I just used right there of basically running around dancing and shooting at the ground and having the bees stay in the cloud. If I could have ran in a little bit smaller circle, I probably wouldn't have had to use as many arrows. I maybe fired a few too many, but that's just me. I'm making sure they're dead. A little bit of overkill never really hurts. But if you guys <clears throat> want to see, if you guys like this content and would like to see more like it, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button and turn on the bell for notifications. And until the next video, 
Y'all have a good one.